Okay everybody, hello and welcome to this video. In this video today, we're going to go through and configure an Android phone with parental controls. Uh, if we assume it's Christmas time and you have an old Android device lying around and you're going to gift that to your child, uh, we can go through and configure it so that you are not handing over a loaded weapon. In fact, you're just handing over the device with specific controls on the device so that they can't rack up large bills so that they can't download and access sites that they should not be accessing and various things like that. So let's begin. I have a phone here which has been completely factory reset and I'm going to change um, and log into this device and we'll go ahead and create an account on this phone. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and tap the start button here or the, on the screen. I'm going to start that. I don't currently have a SIM card in this, which is fine. We could still do the configurations that we need. I'm going to, of course, agree to the end user, agree, end user license agreement. The others are optional, so I'm going to ignore those and just tap next. Here are permissions for Samsung apps and services. In fact, I don't like any of the Samsung apps or services on this phone, so I'm going to turn them all off. If I'm going to use any services, I'm going to use it with one provider, and that will be with Google. I'm happy to turn off all of this noise and click Agree. Of course, now I need to choose a Wi-Fi network and sign in. So let me just pause the video while I create and sign into this to my normal um, Wi-Fi network. As soon as I tapped Connect, the phone has gone and connected to the network, and it started a getting the phone ready. And you can see it's just going through this screen here while it does that configuration. So we'll just wait for that bit to complete. Finally, now you can see it's come up to the copy apps and data. I'm not actually going to transfer anything at this point to this phone. I want it to be fresh. So I'm simply going to tap don't copy. While we're doing that, let me just show you the Family Link web page. I've signed into that on a computer browser on my laptop, and I here is where I can here is where the device will appear once it signs in and we join or link my phone and my child's account to my Family Link here, which is my main training account. 